Hi, my name is Tom and I'm here at Best Buy to talk to you a little bit about troubleshooting your wireless keyboard. So if you've purchased a wireless keyboard and you've already connected it and it stopped working, there's a couple of reasons that your keyboard may no longer be working. Let's go over a few of those. First off, you're going to want to check the batteries in the back. Make sure that your batteries are installed properly and make sure that they're also full of juice. If for whatever reason your batteries are dead, just replace them and that should solve the problem. If replacing the batteries does not solve the, your problem, you can also try to reconnect your wireless keyboard to the wireless receiver plugged into your computer. The way you would do that is push a little red button on the back of the receiver. Now this would cause the receiver to start to flash. Once that happens, find the red button on the back of your keyboard and push that as well. This should reconnect your wireless keyboard. For whatever reason, neither of these solutions happen to fix your problem. You might also want to check your software on your computer. It may not be up to date and you may need to jump online and update your software for whatever company it is that your wireless keyboard is. If you're experiencing any functionality issues with your wireless keyboard, but only on certain functions such as the volume controls and quick keys on your keyboard, you may want to check the software on the manufacturer's website for updates. If there are updates, you're going to want to download those in order to receive full functionality out of your keyboard. 